Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to open Dropbox link without login. Before we start, hurry up and check out your software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering how do you access a Dropbox link here without logging in. So it's actually quite simple. Let's go ahead and open up our account first. So in this case, I actually have this picture here that maybe I want to share or access on my other account. So without logging in. Well, typically, you just need to click on the tree dotted icon here and you have the share option here. So in this case, you could uh, basically share this in any way here. So for example, let's go ahead and click on copy a link here and we want to click on manage. So just to give you some idea here, there are going to be some limitations on uh, basically accessing files without locking in. So if someone or if the access for this one is set to anyone with link, then you won't have any problem accessing the file. So as long as someone has that link, they have the capability of accessing that. Now, if a file has or is currently set to only people invited, then most likely if in this case, if you didn't log in into your account, you won't have, ha have access into that specific file, which is in this case is a security feature of Dropbox here. Again, the if you want to access a file without use or without logging in, the file should have the access that says anyone with link. But it, again, if they if they have the only people invited, then you won't be able to access the file. So I've said this to anyone with link, and I want to click on copy link here, and I actually open up a, a incognito tab here, which in this case uh, I'm not currently logged in into my account. So in this case is going to paste our Dropbox link, and in this case it's going to show you the actual file. So if this is the first time that you're accessing this page, it is going to be a pop-up here that says log in. But to, just to give you an idea, I'm going to open up my incognito window again, press, uh, press the link, and basically access it again. Now you should be, be able to see this login page. So go ahead and click on the X at the top right here, and you should be able to see the actual file picture here. So if you want to save this, just click on download at the top right here, and from here, for you to proceed on downloading it, you need to log in. But then again, you could basically view the photo or video or whatever file that is in here. And from then on, you should be good. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.